<laughs> I spy a wizard foul. What have we here? A magician in a tower, hiding away from the frightening world. What are you so scared of, Magus? Not the night song, surely? Why, she's nothing but a relic to be purchased and pursued. My gods. The night song is a person. At last. There you are, my dear. You will address me with due deference. I am Dame Aelin. And you are a whelp without honor, without pride, with nothing but a tower full of trinkets. Oh, my apologies, Dame Aelin. I meant no disrespect. I asked our mutual friend here to make an introduction that I might get to meet the famed daughter of Saluna. Forgive me for that impudence. Perhaps our friend can bridge the gap and do what I believe they came here to do? Do not play. Do not jest. We have come to square off against an enemy most loathsome. So speak, O oh loathsome one. Give me one good reason why I should not cave your head into your neck. <sighs> Dame Aelin, I have discovered a device that would allow your immortality to be shared. It would cause you no harm, no pain of any kind. You serve your mother, Saluna, I believe. She who has blessed our realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. You dare to threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years! You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. You shall have it. This, I promise you. Traitor! I will bring this tower to the ground before I'll hear another word! Be reasonable, madam. You can't outmatch two powerful wizards. <laughs> there is nothing I cannot do. Ah, <laughs> oh, Aelin. I look forward to getting to know you for the next eternity. Mamadons! Imperatum! It is done! It is done! Now, I must fit her into the device before she resurrects. You, take your payment. Well earned, and be gone! Come, boy! Don't stand there gulping! We have much work to do. Go cry into your sack of gold. You've made a powerful ally today, you know. This tower's capabilities are exceptional. And your enemies are now my own. Should I wish them to be? <laughs> you can count on Ramas's tower in future. Something tells me you won't leave Baldur's Gate without a few... fireworks. <laughs> Aelin left to face that wizard, uh, Laroacan, was it? Even after all she's been through, she thinks herself unstoppable, invincible. It all feels like recklessness to me. I hope you're right. 
He sounds like a vile, vile man. I'd have liked to get a few licks in myself, honestly. I wanted to help her, but she said she fights better when she knows I'm safe. I understand, I suppose. I feel the same about her. She certainly is. And she always will be, won't she? Gods, I miss her already. There you are. Where's Aelin? What? How can... How could some wizard overpower both of you? You defeated the Apostle of Merkel. You mean to tell me this Laroacan was stronger than the god of necromancy? What? You're disgusting. After all the trouble you went through to free her, I should strike you down where you stand. But I'll leave that to Aelin. I'm sure she will enjoy dealing with you herself. No, I lost her. Saluna, always. Isabel, Thorn. My father. The corpse remains silent. The spell's power. Isabel! Isabel! Why did you bring her here? What have you done? When I am free, I will destroy you! I will murder you and your children and their children beside! I will rip this world apart, plank and beam, until every iota of your being is scalded by my light! This is my promise. This is my vow! Aha! When last we met, mercenary, I had yet to attain my true form. Witness me, immortal, until the end of all days! It was no dream I had. It was a plan. Carefully crafted. Carefully executed by sheer force of genius! Fitting. I thank you. And now I give you leave to go. Swimming above the tides of fate, I see so much for me to do. So very much indeed. I give you leave to go. So be gone, and do not call upon Razameth's tower again. When I see its services might be of use to you, I will rally of my own accord.